Hey guys, welcome to a new video. So today we are playing some Arena Valor. Uh, I have this up on my iPad at the moment. This is a mobile MOBA that I talked about earlier today. Um, so we'll be doing some sponsor videos uh, with Arena Valor, kind of celebrating their launch. This is at the moment, if you click the link in the description to download it, called Strike of uh, Kings. But it'll be changing to Arena Valor with the European launch, which uh, is in a few days. So when you go to the App Store, it will have changed. Nice spanky new logo and everything like that. This is uh, from Tencent who are the parent company of Riot. Uh, and actually, honestly, I'm having a lot of fun playing this. Is, I'm playing Busfly at the moment, as you're gonna see. <laughs> She's like an assassin, so she jumps around all the time. She gets a lot of resets and stuff. You can farm, you get more gold if you kill something. Okay, I might be dead here. You get more gold if you kill stuff. <gasps> uh, one more, oh, I still killed him, nice. Okay, you get more gold if you kill stuff. You still get like passive gold with about 60 or 70% of it or something like that around them if they die. It's been in like the first release for a little while already. It's actually, I think it's the most played MOBA game in Asia at the moment, uh, which is now coming over to Europe. So it is uh, a pretty huge game. Uh, there are loads of different characters in it already. You can actually play as loads of DC stuff, like they've got license for that, so like Batman um, and stuff like that. But yeah, so we're just gonna play some of this. Um, we're gonna be doing videos in the next couple of months, celebrating it, playing a bunch of different champions, showing it off. You guys play with me as well, that'll be awesome. My team's dead, but I wonder if I can clean up. I can clean up this, I reckon. Oh, the stun, no way, Are you serious? Oh, that crowd control, no. If I can get like that first reset on my ult when I dive in, then uh, let's go. Oh, that's actually me as well, so. Whoa, where did she go? Hello? Nice. Okay, so you see all my abilities reset, so now I can go on this guy as well. And get him. Use my execute, which is like... Um, uh, it, has a, it has a longer cooldown, but you can actually change them before the game and stuff as well. But my one... Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh, he saw me on the tower. That's not going to be good. I'm actually going to be dead. Oh, I didn't put... Ah, ah. Where are they? Where did they go? By. Oh, they're there, they're there, they're there. Oh, holy moly, what is that damage? Wow, okay. Oh, that is why I like this champ. Gap close on. Come here, you little turd. That tower shot's gonna kill me, I think. I'm gonna press restore, which is like my health potion, I guess. I'm, I'm gonna go back in if I can, but I don't think I probably should. Like, still got minions. I'm gonna go. Oh, that's stun, that's not cool. Oh, that's not cool. That was very close. That was a bit too close, I think. Uh oh. I'm trying to laugh still really bad here. Oh, holy crap. Oh, we won. Oh, oh, we actually won. So in case you were dazzled with my butterfly gameplay from the last game, uh, I'm gonna quickly show you how you play it. Uh, just kind of like the screen, I guess, for other champions as well, so you can kind of check what uh, different champions do when you come and play them. But if you wanna play butterfly, give you a quick rundown. I've been playing her for like three or four hours now, probably. I've just literally been this game. It's actually kind of quite addictive when you're killing everything. So. Butterfly is like an assassin, uh, kind of a reset assassin, a finisher. So she dives in and she uses her all abilities. If she kills somebody, she gets them back and then she just kind of rinse repeats on uh, multiple champions, right? So every champ has a passive, which is his bottom one, two normal abilities, and then kind of an ultimate or a special ability at the very top. Has a bit of longer cooldown, but it's more powerful, obviously. So her passive is when you get killer assist, resets your other cooldowns and you restore 12% health. So you dive in, you use everything, you use your ultimate to dive in, you use the other stuff for damage and then you kill them and then it resets and then you use it on somebody else, right? Just to very quickly, when we go in, like you have this whirlwind which deals damage and reduces their move speed so you can catch onto them a bit more. This one is a skill shot. Uh, it also increases their attack speed for a little bit afterwards. And finally, ultimate, you dive in, you do a lot of physical damage and you increase your damage reduction uh, and move speed by 50%. So uh, like you dive in, you take this damage and you run around quicker basically. But one of the cool things is if I tuck my head out of the way on my green screen, you can see this equipment tab. Do this for every single champion. You can go in and at the very top, uh, it has like an item set build that was showing game, but you can go on pro builds. You can find out what really good players are actually using for the champion and it'll give you a good idea of what to build to start with. If you click the use button, for example, if I want the top one, press use and now this top thing has modified to that. So in game, it's gonna autopilot you to buy the right items and you'll at least be useful, I guess. But also this hero trial button, let's click that. We're gonna load into a kind of a sandboxy trial mode of the, thing, of the champion. You can kind of 
try them out and also show you what the abilities do. So we have these two abilities to start with. Now I've been getting this one first because it does more damage and everybody knows we love damage. So at level three, you can level this one up to the second time. And then if you go up to level four, you can finally unlock your ultimate ability. Uh, obviously ultimate is the most powerful thing, but then after that, it's going to be this one. This is the one I've been leveling up anyway. And uh, if you thumb round it like this, you have, uh, because it's a skill shot, this works for every single skill shot. You literally just hold the button you thumb round to aim it and then you release. If you just press it normally, it goes to the ne uh, nearest champion. So as you can see with my ultimate, if I use it close to this guy, I'm gonna die behind him and get the damage reduction and stuff. This, obviously, if I use here to do some damage, I throw my sword out. And then this one is gonna do some AOE spin and uh, slow as well. But your ultimate actually can be used on minions, so it can be used as like an escape. So that is how you play Butterfly. I hope you guys uh, found this video pretty fun to watch. There'll be some more Arena Valor content on there. Thank you for supporting me. I know it's not exactly what you subscribed for, but I hope you found it interesting and it really does help out the channel. If you wanted to find uh, the other hero, like if you come on this game and you think, okay, yeah, I wanna play this hero, but I don't really know what they do. You just go into the Heroes tab, which is on the left-hand side, click whatever it is, so for Butterfly, for example, and then you go onto this page, which will show you their abilities, and you can have a quick read before you jump into the game, or you just queue up for a standard normal game and uh, get stuck in, I guess. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching, and for now, I'll leave you with the Robots.